everybody, it's Mama J. And Spectre. We are here with the Zanini bag and another Geek Fuel box. A huge Geek Fuel box. Yeah, and I get these for, well, with shipping, they're $27. These are actually, now that the Nick box is gone, these are probably my favorite boxes. Yeah, we, we won't do the Nick box anymore due to some issues with them. And I thought their customer service was really bad. Yeah. Really, really bad. So these have become my favorite yeah. boxes. And actually, if you go on to Groupon, you can get coupons for these boxes. These are like 60 plus dollar boxes, they claim, I think it is. Um, you can get Groupons for 20 bucks on them. And then when you order it from the website, you pay the $7 shipping. Yep. Can't beat it. Nope. Can't beat it. So let's go ahead. I've already cut this bag. Um, and we're going to go ahead and open this bag. This is the Zanini bag, and this is for April. So it came a little early, <laughs> I guess. So let's see what we got here. So the first one is from Breaking Bad, and it is Walter White. And everybody knows Walter White is the Blue Meth King. So there is Walter White. Breaking Bad was an awesome show. To this day, every time I walk by a tinted house or drive by a tinted house, I think of Breaking Bad. That's an awesome pen. The next one is Fred Flintstone from the Flintstones. A really good, really cool pen. That's like, actually really detailed. It's really detailed, really well on his, like, uh, of his body. Every time I see a stone house, I think of Fred Flintstone. <laughs> All right, and then next I have um, Raiden, which I am not sure who Raiden is, so Spectre will probably know. Mortal Kombat. Okay, so he's from Mortal Kombat. It's a cool pin. It actually is shaped kind of like a lightning bolt. That's actually really cool. Pretty cool. Really cool. And next. So that was for the basic plan. Those yeah. three. The first um, three are always the basic plan. And then you can jump up to a standard plan. So the standard plan's theme right now is currently DC. And we have the Flash. Particularly the Wally West Flash. From Justice League TV show and Cartoon Network. From 2007 to 2009. Super cool pin. Um, my favorite flash. That pin will actually probably be heading to somebody else. And actually, by the time this video drops, who knows? They may already have it or they may not. <laughs> Unless you wanted it. Nope. Okay. And then the final one is the premium one, which is currently Star Wars. Yeah. And last month was what? Well, last month we didn't get pins. Last month, they gave you the option um, with the whole coronavirus going on. They weren't going to bring the pins in originally. Um, they were having issues. So what they did last month is they gave you an option. You could choose to be credited for the following month, which is this month's order, or you could pick five pins. I chose to pick five pins because there were five pins that I did want um, because I had some people I wanted to send those pins to. And actually, if you go over and you check out, well, it's probably from a while ago. I'll see if I can find it and link it below. You'll see the four of those pens were opened on 4Pack's channel. <laughs> I sent them each one that I knew suited each one of them. And our last pen is... Baby Yoda. The child. It's Baby Yoda. It does say Baby Yoda on here. Yeah, in the show, he's called The Child. That's because the show is wrong. Baby Yoda. Because <laughs> the show is wrong. So that's actually a really cool pen. And I know Spectre will be keeping this one because he really liked this one. Oh, Mandalorian is the best thing to happen to Star Wars since episode six. So um, we'll definitely be keeping Yoda. I'm not sure about the other three. And then Flash um, already, already has it. Yeah. yeah. 
Definitely right. keeping this one though. So let's put those back in the bag. Those are actually really cool. I do I, want to say these pins are so detailed. I'm gonna tell you if you don't subscribe to Zanini and you enjoy pins, you really should check them out because the pins are so detailed with the backer cards. Um, what does this cost me? Like with shipping, I think fifteen, sixteen dollars, yeah. something like that. And each pin's like eight bucks. Normally. If you go over there and you order the pins individually, they're eight dollars a piece. I do want to say that it's weird that they have the Jedi Order logo here on the bottom, and not the Mandalorian logo. Huh. That is weird. All right, so now we're gonna move on to the Geek Fuel box. You see him take my knife? I just turned that address around. Sure did. <laughs> um. No one can read it. All right, so. All right. All right, go ahead. This way. All right. Ouch. I think I got a cardboard cut. And you want me to give you this? <laughs> All right, so we're gonna open this up. That is packed. Well, it's not really packed. It's just a box in a box. Look. So, oh, and okay, there's a t-shirt. So what it is is this is the Geek Fuel box. Yeah. This is the Geek Fuel um, XP box. So it gives you the shirt. Yeah. So that's the only difference. So, um, <laughs> all right, so wait. why don't you go ahead and take a look at the shirt. I'm not sure. Oh, I am so happy about this shirt. Please tell me it's in my size. It is. I love New New York, Planet Express ship. That's Futurama. Oh, wow. That is super cool. It has the travel tubes and everything. That's actually really cool. Established in $29.99. That's a cool shirt. And the tag up there says Futurama and it has a little picture of Nibbler. Oh, so it's actually licensed merchandise. Yep. All right, well, there's a new shirt for Spectre. Oh, man, I'm so happy about that shirt. Super cool. As he wads it up and puts it on the corner of the it's table. It's kind of semi-folded. <laughs> there. All right, and I'm going to open this box. And this box is packed. <laughs> So this is the basic box. This was the deluxe with the shirt. Yeah, so that's your cheat card. Um, is it? Yes. Oh, it is. Okay. So go ahead and pull something out, Spectre. I'll let you go first. Vampire. Oh, we got something like this before. Yeah, that's uh, Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Got uh, two pins. One of, I'm gonna guess Buffy, and then one of the vampire. Oh, Angel. Yeah, Buffy and Angel. That's cool. Oh, I got the Buffy prom pin. Oh, okay. That's yeah, she's wearing cool. a different outfit. Okay, yeah. Yeah. That's really cool. I got the rare set. That's what it says. Oh, there we go. All right, so I'll take this one, which we've had one like this before. Lord of the Pins. This is Lord of the Pins. And inside we got, I think we, oh no, you got Gandalf. Who is this? You got Gandroid the Grey. Oh, okay. So uh, got... The other one we got, um, Grimbot. Grimbot, yeah. yeah. That's really cool. That's yeah, really those cool. are, those are really interesting. They're nice the way they come in a little sleeve that you can put in a little holder. And set up. Almost looks like a little DVD box, kind yeah. of. Yeah. You know, but those are really cool. So we got two of those. Go ahead. I see what this is. This is a Slurm sticker. What? Oh, you put it on a can? Yeah, because you got to have your can of Slurm. It's highly addictive. It's, now we um, might have to buy one of the um, canned Funko Pops so you can put that on there. <laughs> Yeah, if you don't know what Slurm is, it's also from Futurama. It's like their energy drink Mountain Dew that comes out of a worm's butt. Is that what it is? Yep. Oh, wow. With Slurm's McKinsey. Wow. Okay. All right. Um, There's something else hidden back here. Oh, that's just the regular Geek Fuel. 
cards. So I'll take this. And this is a Rick and Morty squishy. Oh, you got Snowball. Is that what that is? Yep. I got Snowball. Where are his testicles? Do what? Yeah, the, the helmet on his head made him super smart so he can speak. And he wanted to know where his testicles were. Oh, Lord. I've never watched an episode of Rick and Morty. So there's that little... What's his name again? Snowball. Snowball. All right, your turn. Mm. You can take that one. Get it out. There we got. That's a pretty big box. It's a really big box. We got Batman. Q fig. Um, yeah, Q fig. It kind of looks like he's really constipated while he's jumping. We see. Oh yeah. I mean, it's kind of cool. Yeah, that's a cool like little. But that figuring. is really cool. It's not very heavy. He's really light. So that's cool. Alright. And then oh they did give us a geek feel sticker, which we've never got before. And that is also in the style of Futurama. That's is it? The Planet Express logo. Oh. But it's okay. been changed up. Well we got that. And yeah, we actually got a pop this time. Oh. Um, you would have thought a Futurama pop or something with what, yeah. you know, but we got Judith Grimes from The Walking Dead. No idea who that is. I, yeah, we don't watch The Walking Dead, so obviously not a keeper for us, but... Mainly because the show bored me to death. Did it? Yeah. I don't know, everyone says the show's really good. I'm going to have to check it out. Um, I gave it one season. You only gave it one season? I watched the entire first oh. season. Didn't like it at all. I did, however, like the um, season two finale with Herschel when he had his uh, pump action shotgun and it had bottomless clip infinite ammo. Like he shot it like 40 times without reloading that thing. That's funny. All right, so we're going to look up the value here. But I wanted to take a quick glance at the, the card here. So you could have got different pins. Yeah. Because I know that my um, Buffy the Vampire Slayer one says I do have a rare set. Number 500. Oh, and a bonus bonus stickers and a shirt. Yeah. So everything I think is the same except the pins and the little squishy thing could have been different versions of them. And we did not get the rare version of this. The rare no. one is... um. Um, Gollum. Is that what it is? Yeah. All right, so I'm going to look up this pop, though, really quick, just see what the value on the pop is. So I'm pretty sure, because we only pay $20, even though they say it's like $60, it probably is pretty close. Okay, it's a $15 pop. So 15 These are probably 10 bucks a piece, actually. Yeah. I mean, we wouldn't say that. I'd say 5 I would say 6 Seven. But I'm sure they would sell for nine ninety nine somewhere. Yeah, so that Batman say, figure, same thing, probably like fourteen ninety nine somewhere. So shirts are always like fourteen ninety nine. Fifteen to twenty dollars, especially since it's licensed, it's probably twenty. Yeah, then another license, like little thing, ten bucks. Yeah. So. I mean, I did I get my twenty dollars? I got my twenty dollars, big time. Got my twenty dollars. Yeah. So. Um, again, we don't watch Walking Dead, so this will find a new home. And we don't collect Batman. So that will find a new home. <laughs> Did um, you want Buffy the Vampire? No, I think pins? the only thing, sadly, even though this was a great box, the only thing I think that we're truly keeping out of this box is the shirt and the stickers. And um, that's probably it. And we'll throw these in with our pen collections unless somebody... Is a yeah. huge Buffy the Vampire or Lord of the Rings fan. We got two of those. Um, I'm not sure if I still have the other one. Okay. I might. I might. I'll have to look. That's true. I may have two of these still. So. All right. Yep. So you like these boxes? These are boxes are really cool. I think it's, you know. It's the first time we got a Funko Pop in one. We've done like three or yeah. four of these and this is the first Funko Pop. Everything out of it always is very interesting and very, um, well, geek-oriented, which is really nice. Yeah. 
So definitely I will um, probably grab one or two more coupons off Groupon. And I like to space them out because you don't want to get the same box. And they do come numbered. That's volume six. Is it? Did you yes. say? Oh, yeah. Volume six. Because they do actually come numbered. So you just want to make sure that if you do use the Groupon that you're not getting the same volume in the same book. Or the same book. The same box. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Yep. All right. We'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Like a bird on a tree. I'm just sitting here. I got time, it's clear to see From up here, the world seems small We can sit together, it's so beautiful Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit the bell!